Hey guys, it's CJ from SmartKTai.com. So Netflix updated their official app for Android today, and with it they added support for more phones from various manufacturers like HTC, Samsung, and Motorola. I'll be sure to include the full list in the description of this video. Anyway, Netflix also added support for the Lenovo IdeaPad series, so that makes it the first time that we're seeing the Netflix streaming app available for a Honeycomb tablet. Well, guess what? The updated Netflix APK file can actually be installed on other Honeycomb tablets as well, like the Motorola Zoom, the Samsung Galaxy Tab 10.1, and so on. And it actually works. Unofficially, of course, but it still works. We'll post a link to that inst installation file in the description as well. Anyway, let's see how the Netflix app performs on this Galaxy Tab 10.1. So we'll go ahead and launch it. Of course, here we have it on the HTC Evo 3D which also got support for the Netflix app today. You can see it works just fine. Let's go ahead and demo it on the phone first. We'll go with this movie here. Let it load up. All right, and let me just fast forward here, get in on some action. And you can see it works just fine. All right, so that is the Evo 3D running the Netflix app. So that got official support uh, for the Netflix application. So here we have it running on the Samsung Galaxy Tab 10.1. Like I said, this is unofficial. You'll have to manually install the APK file to get it up and running on your Honeycomb tablet unless you have uh, one from Lenovo, of course. So here we go. It basically looks the same on the tablet, just a little bit more expanded. You can see it's a little bit laggy here when you scroll around. But that's all right, as long as it works, right? So here we are at home. We can go to genres, tap on TV, check those out. You can do a search. Let's try that again. Search, take a look at the queue. And then we'll go ahead and load something up. So I'll go back and how about we resume whatever I was looking at before. I believe this is 24. And I'll zoom in a little bit. So you can see it works just fine. Okay. Now the quality is pretty good. It's watchable. But Cole. obviously since it's a large screen tablet, uh, it can be uh, optimized a little bit more. So let's jump back out of here. And we'll go ahead and just click on a movie so you can see what that looks like when you expand the information. All right. So this was Netflix running on an Android Honeycomb tablet. We hope Netflix will officially add support for more tablets in the future. But until then, this should work in the meantime for you tablet users out there. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't yet. As usual, thanks for watching.